I've always had an interest in politics, especially state government. Uh, ever since high school, I was involved in different political uh, groups. And there's always just been a fascination. Uh, I think people take it for granted what happens, especially at the state level. They don't understand how important state government is and how powerful it can be, especially if you have a voice and you're willing to use that voice. And I wanted to see how it ran and why it ran the way it did. I'm, I like to take things apart and put them back together. So working firsthand with, with a senator was, it helped me understand why it worked the way it does. My first position was with the late Senator Rhodes, uh, the chairman of the uh, Education Committee. I helped with the committee itself, and I also did constituent services, uh, PennDOT, birth certificates, notary applications, and processed anything we could to help out his constituents. Well, I was the first thing the constituent would see when they walked in the office, or I was the first person to answer the phone. So it was really my job to get the constituent relationship started from the beginning on a good, a good track. Senator Pledgy hired me to fill in uh, temporarily. I was there again to be at the front desk to uh, manage the flow of the office. Senator Pledgy's office is a very large office with a lot of people. So it was my job to make sure that everyone was at the right place at the right time and they were at the correct meetings and the correct locations. It was also there to, again, handle constituent relations as I did for Senator Rhodes' office. Senator Vogel's office gave me an opportunity to expand. Uh, when he became the chairman of the Agricultural and Rural Affairs, Rural Affairs Committee, I was able to take on the secretary position, working directly with the executive director to make sure that committee meetings, committee hearings were set, we had a location, also to pr help him prepare legislation to move them out of the committee, do research on the bills that sat in the committee. In all three of the offices that I worked for in the Senate, it was teamwork was very important because without it, things wouldn't get done. Many people had many responsibilities, particularly in Senator Vogel's office. With the, when he took over the chairmanship of the Agricultural Committee, as the secretary, it was my job to set up committee meetings and things like that. But without my communication to the executive director or the communication to the senator or the chief of staff, things, wouldn't have, things couldn't occur in the right order. We also needed to have the, that communication and teamwork with, the, with our leadership as well. Senator Rhodes was an amazing person to work for. As somebody who had the years of experience, nearly 30 years before he passed, he had when at the, with the state senate. So to learn hands-on from him was unbelievable. He was a true champion of the senate itself. So from him particularly, I, I learned a lot of valuable skills in the process itself because he was really hands-on when it came to teaching his staff what he wanted and how he wanted things done and explain them. So that's an experience that I'm going to take with me for the rest of my life and he's somebody who I will never forget and I honestly can't walk into that building without thinking of him. I'm able to help the clients at Triad by tracking bills, tracking legislation. That's particularly important to the clients. There are certain bills that move and they move very quickly, so by understanding the way the legislative process goes and understanding what it means when a bill is moved over or it's being run that day, I'm able to easily access that information and get that information to our government relations department so that they're able to update the clients immediately to what particular legislation interests them. In order to get the daily headlines out, uh, Ginger 
forwards me um, her research that she has done in the, the morning. So it is very important that her and I stay open and communicating with each other that the, the proper headlines are getting out. Uh, and especially then during the week to make sure the proper people are seeing the proofing the materials before they go out. Um, ultimately, it's my responsibility to hit send. So it goes out and if the proper people haven't seen it, you know, thing, that's when things can, can fall apart. And so it is really important for all of us to work together as a strong team and keep communication open so that we're all always on the same page. And when that information gets sent, it's what we all agreed upon as a team and so that the clients are seeing what they want to see and are happy with the daily newsletter because actually I enjoy reading them <laughs> every day.